Welcome to the tutorial on Programming Features of Eclipse. In this tutorial, we will learn about the user-friendly features of Eclipse. For this tutorial, we are using Ubuntu 11.10, JDK 1.6 and Eclipse 3.7. To follow this tutorial, you must have Eclipse installed on your system and you must know how to write a simple Java program in Eclipse. If not, for relevant tutorials, please visit our website as shown. Eclipse IDE supports many user-friendly features such as auto-completion, syntax highlighting, error dialog box, and shortcut keys. We will look into each of these features in detail. I have created a class named features and added the main method. We will first look at the auto completion feature in Eclipse. Inside the main method, type an opening brace and hit enter. We can see that it automatically sets the corresponding closing brace and also positions the cursor with an indentation. It also completes every feature that works in pairs. For example, Parenthesis. Type open parenthesis. We can see that we only have to type the open parenthesis and Eclipse automatically adds the closing parenthesis. Also note that if you are accustomed to typing the closing parenthesis also, then it takes care of it by not adding the extra closing parenthesis. I am now typing the closing parenthesis and note that only the cursor moves to the right and the extra parenthesis is not added. It works in similar fashion with double quotes also. Type opening quotes and it automatically closes the quotes. If you are accustomed to type the closing quotes also, it takes care of it by not adding the extra quote. I am now typing the quote and notice that the cursor moves to the right but the extra quote is not added. Auto completion is a very versatile feature and helps a lot in maintaining the structure of the code and also prevents typing errors like missing closing braces, missing closing parenthesis and missing closing quotes. The next programming feature we will look at is suggestion. Remove all that we just typed. We will type the output statement to print the word hello. system dot. Notice that Eclipse displays a drop down list. The list contains suggestions like ERR, IN, OUT, CONSOLE, all sorts of possible completions. Scroll down to OUT and press ENTER. Again type a dot. Now Eclipse provides suggestions from the OUT module. Scroll down to print ln. And press enter. Now, inside the parenthesis, in quotes, type hello. The next feature we'll be looking at is the syntax highlighting feature. Note that the keywords public class, public static void are all in a different color. Also note that the word hello is in blue color indicating that this is a string. The syntax highlighting feature helps us to differentiate between keywords and different parts of the code. Eclipse also helps the programmer to find out errors. In a program, Error is denoted by a red cross symbol on the left margin. In this program, we can see there is an error and mouse over on the error. We can see that the error says semicolon missing and the solution to resolve the error is also shown. If we proceed to the run without fixing the error, 
right click select run as java application we have an error dialog box indicating that there is an error asking should we proceed or not for now let us proceed we notice that there is output indicating that there is an error and when we go to problems console all the problems with possible solutions are listed so let us resolve the error by adding the semicolon control s to save the next programmer friendly feature of eclipse is the shortcut keys the common shortcut keys in any program are control s for saving and control o for opening eclipse has shortcut keys for many such commonly used functions control f11 is the shortcut for running the code let us try it now hold control and press f11 and we see that the code is run and the output hello has been printed the shortcut keys for other options can be found by looking at the menu click run and notice that on the right end of the option there is a shortcut given so the shortcut for debug is f11 this is just a small but most commonly used list of the programming features of eclipse we shall look at more features in subsequent tutorials this brings us to the end of the tutorial in this tutorial we have learned how to use programming features of eclipse such as auto completion syntax highlighting error dialog box and shortcut keys as an assignment for this tutorial write a simple program with a class that prints hello in the process apply all the programming features of eclipse observe the functions to know more about the spoken tutorial project watch the video available at the following link it summarizes the project if you do not have good bandwidth you can download and watch it the spoken tutorial team conducts workshops using spoken tutorials gives certificates to those who pass an online test for more details please write to contact at spoken-tutorial.org the spoken tutorial project is a part of the talk to a teacher project it is supported by the national mission on education through ict mhrd government of india more information on this mission is available at the following link this tutorial has been contributed by talent sprint thanks for joining